another one of these big packages. I think the last Coleman product I reviewed on was uh, long too. So anyway, these are travel towels and there's many different manufacturers that make a version of these. This just happens to be Coleman's version. And I guess there's 10. Um, this was about two, I think two dollars, a little over two bucks, maybe just under two dollars, but um, I've purchased similar products like this at the dollar store, but um, the dollar store doesn't seem to carry these as frequently as they used to. Not not the Coleman brand, but a different brand. Um, the cool thing is this has a little tube. The one at the dollar store were just like uh, foil. They were like, um, well, here I'll show you. The ones at the dollar store were packed similar to how pills are packed. This one uses a tube, and I've seen some some of these sold where the tube is even a lot stronger than this uh, um, but for two bucks I thought it was worth a try so they're very compressed and I would say they're about the size of a nickel a little bit bigger than a nickel and you know if you had to stack several nickels together that would give you the thickness and there's t I guess there's 10 in here it's not very heavy so basically they show a water faucet but you know if you're gonna be camping with them you're not gonna be out I mean you're not gonna be near a kitchen sink so and there's just a little bit of water in this bottle so I thought I'd just try to activate it with just what was in here. This is what the plate's for. So I don't know if they're paper. I, I'm assuming they're paper. Whoa. That's cool. Yeah, these look very similar to the dollar store ones. But like I said, unfortunately, I haven't seen them in the dollar store, the, the brand that they used to sell in the dollar store. Um, I've never seen Coleman brands sold in a dollar store, so... Yeah, yeah, this looks very similar. It's got the little holes. Yep, this is just like the stuff I used to buy, except this is Coleman. See how there's little holes? So if it's if it's just like the stuff I remember, it's uh, very durable. Um, I think it is paper. Let's see if I can rip it. No, no, it's not. It's not a hundred percent paper. There's something else in there. Unless they've found a way to weave the paper very, uh, very good, so it's durable. But I think it. Yeah, I think they uh, they've either have found a way to make the paper very strong, or it's got something else in there with it. So since it's not what I consider a hundred percent paper towel, um, what did they call it? Yeah, they just call it travel towels. So. Anyway, I think I think it's a pretty cool product. Um, can't say that I've really used them. I've purchased other brands, like I've said, and haven't really used them. But for a couple bucks, throw it in your bug out bag, and at least you know you have some towels that are obviously more durable than a paper towel by itself. So. Yeah, I would say that these are more durable than an average paper towel. So you could really scrub something with these. So if you're interested, um, this was purchased at Walmart as well. I was at Walmart the other day and I just picked up a couple things that were cheap. Um, and I don't know. It might be
might be one of those frivolous items, but for two or three dollars, who cares? It's just cool. Okay, thanks for watching.